that's all right. Like, overrated as fuck, in my opinion. I mean, and you know what, though? That's typically how the bullshit goes. You feel me? Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Your Thoughts, where I take the community's thoughts and put them into a video. And in this episode, we are talking about what the best thing is about Nikolai Belinsky. If you guys haven't been watching my videos, I joined the Facebook Call of Duty Zombies group, and I've just been asking the community simple questions to try and get a feel for how everybody feels about everything. With that being said, let's get into our first two comments that say Nikolai's ending and the fact that he went from a clueless drunk to being the main one to set the universe right. Now, I couldn't agree more with both of these comments. As you can see, Nikolai's journey from being an alcoholic in the Ultimus crew to being an absolute savage in the Primus crew to eventually becoming the leader of the Primus crew to get the Ultimus crew. Now he's the leader of both the crews and he accepted the fate that Richtofen just could not handle and he had to make sure that Ultimus and Primus died because they were always going to fail. No matter how many times they did the cycle, they were never going to break it, and he had to accept that fate, and it shows how strong of a leader and a character he is. Now our next comment talks about Nikolai's backstory, and I absolutely love Nikolai's backstory. For those of you who don't know, in 1941, in the original timeline, Germany advanced into the Soviet Union, and that is when his wife died, and that's when he turned to vodka. And then the year after that, in late December, his brother was also killed in the Battle of Stalingrad. And then a year after that, he was captured by Group 935. And there's just so many cool elements to his backstory, and there's even a really cool theory that I looked into. And it says that whenever he drank the vodka and he talked about all of his other wives, they were actually imaginations that he dreamt of in his head and they were never real. He only ever had his one wife and all of the other ones that he kills just couldn't compare to his original wife. And I think that adds so much to his character. After that, the next best thing about Nikolai is the fact that he never gave up and he's determined and I couldn't agree more. He's a very determined person. He's loved. He's lost, and now he's the one that set the universe straight, not even Richtofen. So that just shows you how great Nikolai is. And then after that, we have the fact that you can unlock his katana in Giant. I don't know about you guys, but I love using Nikolai's katana. I don't think it's in Giant, but you know what? It's okay. Up next, we have Steven's comment. Nikolai 1.0 is funny, and Nikolai 2.0 has a really good backstory. And again, love the backstory. I'll have a link down below for you guys to check out his backstory. Up next, we have the fact that he has six wives, and Dale says that that is six sets of problems, 93 more, and you can call him Jay-Z. Lads, our boy Nikolai is so close to being called Jay-Z. Can we just get him 93 more wives? Now I know what our next comment is trying to say, so let me just get the quote from the game for you. That smells disgusting, like my fourth wife. She pretty though. Pretty and smelly. Weird combo. Up next, we have the fact that Nikolai is hilarious, whether it's the Ultimus or the Primus version, but Primus Nikolai is a lovable bear, and I could not agree more. And since nobody else put it in the comments, I think we all have to appreciate Nikolai's hair. It is on point. It is on, dare I say, fleek. It is all parted to the side, looking fresh, like he just got it cut, like he wasn't battling hordes of zombies for the past couple of years. This man has the best hair out of the crew. Our next comment says, been one drunk son of a bitch. And my favorite line is when you run out of ammo and he says, I'm out of ammo. Maybe I should just drink instead. Piss on someone. Up next, we have the fact that Nikolai is a high-functioning alcoholic. Now, I'm not saying that I have a favorite alcoholic. If I did have a favorite alcoholic, his name would be Nikolai Belinsky. Coming up next, we have alcoholism and the fact that he reeks of communism and piss. And now we come down to what makes Nikolai the very best character. Ladies and gentlemen, Nikolai is a great character because of... Vodka!
I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure to smash that like button. That's right. Normally, I don't ask that you smash the like button. But do it for Nikolai. Nikolai would want you to smash that like button like he can smash a bottle of vodka. You feel me? And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.